Back in the book segment tonight, Waters World. As you may know, we send Waters all over the country to illuminate things that perplex us. And so it is that we wanted to know if Hollywood is disappointed with President Obama. So we sent Waters to the Sundance Film Festival to find out. <laughs> John, what are you doing here? I'm trying to enjoy the film festival. What do you think? Are you acting right now, or is this reality? That is the stupidest question. <laughs> Shut up. You're getting pretty famous now. No, not really. You're getting there. Though. No, I think you think I'm Jonah Hill, and I'm not. You have my money taped to your boobs. Okay, technically, you do work for me. What do you think the most important problem is in America right now? Oh, jeez. Come on. This is what you're going to ask me. The biggest problem? Wealth inequality. The one that's most personal to me is, is global warming. I can't feel my toes right now. Well, this is this is not a perfect example of global warming. I like warm hugs. In 2014, the red and the blue is in, is literally split down the middle. I think that the disparity between the rich and the poor continues. So instead of taking the really wealthy and then shrinking them down to the size of the poor, maybe we should lift the poor up instead. Those things are what publish our humanity. Qualifying confused everybody must be. Are you disappointed in President Obama at all? No. Why I'm not? disappointed in Bill O'Reilly. I think he will go down as without a doubt having cleaned up Jimmy Carter being the worst president ever. <laughs> I think the health plan I know it's not perfect, but Jesus, we got to start somewhere. With all the record unemployment and yeah. the Benghazi scandal and the Obamacare debacle. Oh, the Benghazi scandal, we kind of know that's, I mean, you and I agree that that's BS now, right? Why is that BS? American ambassador was assassinated and there was no protection well, for him well, and he wasn't arrested. Well, what was the scandal, though? Well, because there was no protection for him. Yeah. He was never arrested. But who cut the, who cut the, the who's cutting? Who Who's cutting the protection? Who's cutting the budget? Who did? The Republicans. Because you know the Senate Intelligence sir, Committee I'm determined so that cuts had on. nothing to do with the protection. But I want Hillary. Yeah, big Hillary fan? Big Hillary fan. Well, la de frickin' da! Bill O'Reilly has a quick question for you. Big fan? By any chance? No? Wow. Okay. He just wants to know if you feel let down by the president. Please answer the question. He's a guy who means to do the right thing. He has to pick his battles, but his heart is in the right place. He's not a schemer. He's not devious. Well, now, who ever told you that? You worried about him reading your emails or listening to your phone calls? I'm not no. at all. The NSA, snooping, none of that gets on your nerves? Oh, dude. <laughs> dude. Dude, it's not funny, dude. Bill O'Reilly says hello, by the way. Oh, tell him I asked you. <laughs> Get out of here. Big fan of Bill's, and I collect all of his books. He worked with us. I remember O'Reilly when he was a cub reporter at ABC. Yeah? What yeah. was Bill like back in the day at ABC? He was an <laughs> <laughs> What? All right. Did you ever watch the O'Reilly Factor on Fox News Channel? Oh, no. You seem like a big Factor fan. That surprises me. No, 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 no. Yes. Yes! To be that's a somebody. pigeon, right? I have a problem with pigeons. Craig. <laughs> He's trained to fly. Whoa, back whoa. To you. That guy is screwier than you are. I'm a huge Factor fan. I love Bill O'Reilly. Bill, you're the I'm nicest excited. guy in the world. First time I met him, he goes, yeah, yeah, you, yeah, you're good. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Here now is water. So were they happy to see you in generally <laughs> no, speaking? Not water? at all. No, I actually got admonished by the brass at Sundance because I asked Mark Ruffalo about Benghazi. Yeah. And, and Redford's guys called me and said, you can't ask people about that. You have to ask them about their movies. Why not? Why couldn't you ask? Ruffalo looks like he's at least a thinker. I mean, he knew what you were talking right. about. He was a right? thinker and he was articulate and he yeah, engaged. He was, he Marissa was wrong, Tomei, but, but... she just ran away. Yeah, well, I would too, Waters. If I saw you, <laughs> I'd bolt. Now, a lot of guys ran away, though. The, let's explain. The Sundance Film Festival is a Robert Redford thing, right? right? And it's independent movies right. that, that Hollywood people go there, and they try to sell those movies right. so you get them into the theaters, right. right? You have big guys that come pick them up and buy them and then distribute them. So everyone's competing to see who has the most buzz and the hottest film. But they have these gifting suites, okay? So all the celebrities flock and they snatch up as much free stuff as they can. Did you get free stuff? I, I didn't get anything. You okay? got nothing. No, I just got just, a steak dinner. That's just about it. 
respectful. Right. That's right. All right. So the celebrities are there, and and they're brought in by the movie companies and right. this and that to schmooze. Right. So you can understand when you show up asking about Benghazi. <laughs> right. I know. No, they didn't want anything to do with me. Throw them off the game. Philip Seymour Hoffman ran so fast yeah. away from me when I tried to ask him. You know, he was smoking a cigarette. I went up to him and said, "Philip, you know, I'd love to talk to you about the president." And he just turned the other he way bolted. and skedaddled. Now, De Niro um, was he like you know. I was personally intimidated by De Niro because he's one of my he's big got that, idols. He's, he's got that look. I you know. know. Yeah. I think he was going to kill me with his eyes. Right. But he was nice, and I just didn't ask any follow-up questions because I was a little intimidated. Right. I wish I'd like to. He's a slow talker, though. You can't get him on yeah. live. But I'd yeah. like to see what. But all of these people outside of Wayne Newton, right? They're all liberal people. The lone right? conservative. I think Mitt Romney actually showed up because he's got a film there, and he yeah. got a little applause when he went in there. But no, everybody. You didn't liberal. see Romney though, right? No, I didn't see Romney. You know, I tried to RSVP and get invited, but they denied me. They denied, they denied Romney. Romney people denied you. Can you believe you? that? <laughs>